matchup. Uh, I feel like that's a, a bit rare to see that someone favor Pikachu over Kirby in this matchup. Yeah, I, I'm a little surprised too, but Rob, uh, at this point, Robert's uh, Pikachu is a much better character than his Kirby. Yeah, he, he used to go for the matchup, but he, I guess he he's convinced Pikachu is the best character in the game, right? So Pikachu should win every matchup, so there's no need, I guess, for the Kirby. I, I just think that about Fox. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, we haven't seen Fox do too well against Kirby today, but there there are Fox, you know, Foxes that can do very well in that matchup. Yeah. Uh, uh, great, good, great punish there. Uh, follows up the up B, knows exactly where he's going to go. So, Lodo is actually very strong in this matchup as well. He, he plays online as well, but he gets practice against Marbles in okay. Florida. Uh, Marbles, I would say, is very solid at this matchup. So, Lodo probably, you know, that's a pretty good experience for him. He played the cruise last night, and he he destroyed Zero's Pico. Really? Now I'm going to say Zero's probably both tired and or intoxicated. I don't know, but Lodo looked, he looked on fire. Yeah. Not Robert, looking, uh, just yeah. not looking on fire against Robert. Robert is controlling the neutral, just baiting him at every chance. And he's not really dropping uh, edge guards either, which, no. uh, as we discussed, is very important for this matchup. Oh, that was a bit of an anxious pop from off stage. But Lodo's he might not have been going for a flat drop up there. Uh, got the roll and stuff. Like yeah, Lodo's not cleaning up. He's not finishing his punishes, and Robert is. It's going to make the difference here. Oh wow. That was a bit impatient for the yeah. uh, top pick. He might have been able to follow up with, say, uh, an air instead. Yeah, and with the way Robert's been edge guarding this. Ooh, there's oh, some wow. missed input there. Uh, great awareness from uh, Lodo to DI back in the safe zone. So. Mm. And Robert's up 4 to 1 now. Yeah. Uh, again, that can change pretty quickly, but. Lotus got to start finishing his punishes. Yeah. Get, get a lead or two. And it looks like uh, Robert's opting, to, uh, like we talked about Marvel's doing, just letting go of the edge right away. Great forward air. Oh, but he didn't have yeah. the down air at the last follow up. Um, oh, wow. So, oh, great up smash on that tech chase, but he, again, dropping another punish. Looks like he just didn't make it to that top platform. And uh, misses the tech read. Lodo looks a little shook. He's he's, uh, he's missing a couple things. Yeah. Robert's in his head. You know, when you play that clean in that matchup, yeah. it's very hard to, to it's keep it composed. Like, on the Pika side, you're getting a Falcon that's every single time you guys interact in neutral. He's getting a grab. He's just doing up air, up air, up. He's doing as many up airs as possible, up being you. He can do that as many times as he wants. He's yeah. just exerting his will on you. There's Pika. You know, you get grabbed once you're off stage, you're edge guard, you're thinking, there's no way I can possibly get back from this because edge guarding options feel too strong. Yeah. So it's just, it's very hard to, you know, lock it down and realize that you're still in this. You can do exactly the same thing that they're doing to you and bring it back. And just uh, great again from Robert, keeping it nice and simple off of the line. Robert's just, he's been playing so clean. Yeah. Um, this guy, huge improvements last year. Oh wow, um, misses the upper there. Starting at Genesis 3, he's he's going to college up north now. He doesn't have a ton of players in the scene up there, but again, online makes a big difference. Yeah. Lodo getting another punish, but again, it doesn't doesn't take the stop. You don't want Pika at too high percentage. And another defensive up air. I didn't get that much out of it. Uh, up with, um, show, 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 show. He's got, he's got some percentage. This is a dangerous percentage for Falcon. Yeah. Um, yeah. He, Pikachu can combo him very well. Yeah. I think I think 16 is the magic percentage for Falcon to where he. Uh, oh no, that's that's offensively. When Falcon's yeah, at yeah. very low percentage, it's very hard for Pikachu to do anything but grab him. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, definitely once, yeah, like you said, once Falcon gets a higher percent, Pikachu, it opens up more safe options. Than no. Great forward air and neutral from Lodo. Robert and, uh, has... Great up B. Uh, Might have been because that forward air was uh, stale yeah. from the first one. Um, Robert has very good DI, so it's going to be very hard to make that combo work. Yeah. I think Lodo needs to opt for something a, a little different. Uh, we've seen Alvin and some, uh, several other players lately They're getting the forward air at the ledge, doing a delayed up air into up B. And that 
pretty much takes VI out of the equation. Yeah, um, and it's it's such a safe option too. Um, Lotus starting to finish up his punishes now. Yeah, uh, this is looking a lot closer than the first game. So uh, so off. far, Lotus adjusting pretty well. Interesting. Oh, he caught his oh, he caught jump. His jump. Yeah. Yeah. Right there from Robert playing that game. If Lodo waits and comes up with a rising down air, Robert, not dead, but in an unfavorable position. But Lodo with impatience. Oh, uh, good combo from Lodo. It's not going to kill. Yeah, no. it's high percentage. Ooh. Stop talking about that. <laughs> it's, hard, it's hard to call, man. Oh, uh, great space in there at the back here, there. And the time canceling the show. So that's usually a. Uh, that, that ledge hop to forward air to the side pipe usually works oh, pretty grand. well, but it should. It's a very dangerous option. We saw and, Soda, uh, or Lodo actually punish that one. We saw a great DI from Robert there going uh, too high for uh, Lodo to catch another up there. Yeah, as much as we like to joke about Falcon combos being guaranteed, like, they can DI out of it. Yeah. I think a reverse up air might have finished that. Oh, but Lodo comes it, back the other way yeah. and brings wow. that game all the way back. That was uh, pretty, pretty, well, Robert started that one off pretty strong as well. Yeah. But yeah. Lotus started finishing his combos. It's what it comes down to. And uh, just being able to come back from being down like that, uh, really just a testament to Lotus' experience in the matchup. And Lotus had a couple mix-ups in the neutral, some pretty interesting things like the short hop nares and uh, the forward airs. Four airs were a lot more successful than the Nairs, yeah. though. The Nairs, I don't think it was working too much, but I think it's a tech that people are testing out a little more. Yeah, you gotta and, uh, try everything yeah. and see, see what works, because that will work against someone. That will yeah, work yeah. against a good player. And uh, the Light Nair, it's, uh, you can get some pretty interesting follow-ups on it. For sure. Ooh. A great defensive up air. Oh, the uh, get-up attack is so good against Falcon. Oh, and oh wow! All he had to do was get away, and, and somehow it makes it back wow. after all that. A great recovery series from Moto. Oh, <laughs> oh wow! I think he didn't get the initial turnaround he wanted. He yeah. just decided to just stay there and grab it. Because <laughs> if he turned around after that, he was gonna get hurt. And this should be a stop. Yeah. And Lodo is still down a stock though, but um, if he's able to finish out his punishes, uh, this very well could be his game. Uh, those up smashes, he's, he's got to be sure that Robert's going to hop into that. Ooh, good job from Robert, anticipating the dash in and getting a grab out of it, but oh, uncharacteristic edge guard from Robert. Yeah, it looked like Lodo uh, purposely went a little low there. And I think, uh, yeah, I think just the downer would have worked yeah. there. He might have been out of range, but it's hard to say. Yeah. Robert closing out that edge guard. Maybe cleaning his game up a bit. Oh, wow. Just wow. Pikachu oh. inside his grab range. Uh, Lodo not expecting it. Yeah, you see that happen a lot with uh, Falcon and Fox where they'll grab through yeah. the other person. Just, it's pretty goofy to see, but... It's still some things we don't quite know about. We know about them, but we don't, like, be like... We're not, like... Oh man, that should have worked for sure. Yeah. <laughs> and there we go again, uh, just dashing through each other and grabbing. Lodo's really hungry for a grab right now. So. Yeah, I mean, at this point, this is when he needs to lock down the most. It's, oh, hard read from Robert. And, and this could be it right be here. It. Yeah. And Robert, after Lodo came storming back that second yeah. game, that was a strong four stock in that last game.